Thank you. So yesterday after leaving out of the hair store, spending $84, and I think that said 24 cents, I went into the little bodega, little spot that they got, um, little makeshift market to get me some um, saltfish because I wanted to make some ackee and saltfish. And I ended up making an ackee and saltfish today. But inside this little market, they got a nice little variety of things. I'm actually kind of shocked that I don't have to go too far to get some of the things that if I was in the city still, I could have ran in a corner store or a mini mart in the hood and they would have had all this available. So it definitely brought back city vibes to be able to be able to go somewhere and, you know, still feel like you in the hood somewhere. Because it ain't nothing like that out here in the suburbs. But I'm used to that. So, basically, I done found the saltfish that I want. Of course, I went for the cheapest kind. Because we working on a budget. So, they had this $4.99 by Tropical. And this is what I ended up purchasing while I was in the store. And I also had to get me some plantain chips. Because I just love plantain chips. So, I always go for the garlic. And I ended up getting two bags at uh, that time. So this is the next day. And y'all are going to see me prepare my salt fish by running it under the water and letting some of the salt just like flow, flow out the bag. Y'all know I like stuff to flow out. Just let it flow out. So what you want to do to prepare your ackee, you want to basically get it ready. Let it do that. Rinse it a few times. In, not the ackee, your salt fish. And you want to put it in a pot of water and let it boil on the stove. While I was doing that, I made me some coffee, of course. And here he come. Chow. He just loved my life. So while the salt fish is boiling, I'm like, okay, I'm going to use every last little bit because y'all know we on a budget. And I am going to wash these little bit of dishes so I could keep it pushing. You know what I mean? I love to cook in a clean kitchen. And even though it's only a few items, these items need to come out my sink. So together, I'm going to get that done and I'm going to get that bleach and I'm going to wash these good old dishes and I'm going to clean as I go. So the agenda is to clean as you go. But most people don't even like cooking like regular food. And I'm just like a foodie. So anything I put my mind to, I am going to do it. So this is me showing y'all that y'all y'all oven have a self-clean um, feature. So it takes four hours and 30 minutes for your oven to self-clean. So I think y'all should start utilizing that feature on y'all stove tops and clean out your ovens okay i think y'all really should i think i'm giving instructions in this video from here on out so i'm gonna go ahead and stop this voice over here and let y'all hear what's going on oh well i guess before that i'm showing y'all that it is 10 o'clock and i am done with my first uh boil for the saltfish and I think I'm going to do it one more time. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. I think I'm going to do it one more time before I um set it to the side as if it's done. But, yeah, that's exactly what I'm doing right here. I'm pouring off the excess water because when you boil in the salt from the salt fish, you want to basically get rid of excess salt being inside your pot. So, I definitely give it a nice little wrench again and i let the water run off you see that i'm always gonna let some water run off of something baby let that water run on off run on down baby run on down run on down and that'll be my second boil so basically it go through a process to get that salt fish from being so salty so don't be salty and don't unsalt your salt fish for your Aki and saltfish, if that makes sense. But baby, you don't have to do what I do. You don't have to listen to me. I'm just showing y'all what I do in my kitchen. And these are the things that I do. So either you just going to cook or you're going to watch and you're going to spend your money because you you a blessed beacon of light. You got money. You got money. So you can go ahead and buy a $30 Aki and saltfish platter probably with some food from the you know, Jamaican spa instead of buying you a $20 can of Aki and a $5 bag of saltfish and making a meal that can last um, longer than that one plate for $20, $30, okay? Okay? So here you see me um, measuring out three tablespoons because that's how I'm going to prepare the things that I cut up for the Aki and saltfish, which is the, um, what's that called? 
the vegetables. But then again, it should have been a video showing y'all first of me cutting up the vegetables. And we didn't even see that. So I'm going to stop this right here and do a little flip-flop, little flip-flop and get this thing in order. Because it's not the order, baby. Y'all should be seeing me do the other part first. Y'all shouldn't be at this part. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fix it. Give me one second right now. You better not pull that in. You better not. You better stop. So, baby, you know I had to do my due diligence and go and think back to what I posted. But, baby, that um, I'm right on time. I'm supposed to be dumping the garlic in here, the onions that I cut up. Because, guess what? I showed y'all that in the previous video, which is titled Overthinking is the Thief of Growth. So, baby, we not stealing my growth because, baby, I posted it already. So, yes, y'all see me basically... Um, putting the onions, the peppers, and the garlic inside the pan with the butter in preparation for the meal that I am about to receive and as I prepare for the nourishment of my body. So with that being said, if I'm talking to this, I don't know, but we're about to find out because I really don't have nothing else to say to give y'all a step-by-step -step besides this is the good old onions and peppers being sauteed to get ready for the saltfish, which what I will put in here next. So I learned rather quick that I didn't say anything else, but I am showing y'all each seasoning that I am going to use as I cook this Aki and saltfish, which I put down the black pepper, the onion powder, the garlic powder, the crushed red pepper, and I have the Maggie fish seasoning. Here you do see the saltfish that I done boiled. Since it's nice and boiled, it's just a little pinch. Break it right on up. Break it right on up and put it in the pan over them vegetables, baby. That's all you got to do is get them pieces of saltfish and break them right on up. I wasn't sure if I was going to put all of them in there, the whole pack. But it's like, why not, girl? I got one whole can of Aki that I'm going to use. And that's plenty of saltfish for the Aki. I like it, you know, good. That's all that matters. I'm going to use what I got to get what I want. I did have two cans of Aki, but baby, I'm, I'm, I'm budgie. I'm trying to budget, 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 bougie on the budget is what I was about to say. But baby, I ain't really bougie. I just, it's just really my lifestyle. Like, I can't say that I'm bougie because I just have standards that I don't stray away from. I like what I like. And when you like what you like, you do what you do. And because I cook, I can have the luxury of eating the things that I desire versus spending $70 on one plate. I can cook a meal for my whole family for that amount. And that's how I see um, the betterment of for my household. That's what works for me. Y'all do what works for y'all because I'm going to definitely do what works for me each and every time with no problem. Each and every time with no problem. I'm going to do what works for me. Y'all should do what y'all what works for y'all. And you know what? It's always going to be okay to basically have standards for yourself. Because just know you've been worth it. I know that I've been worth it. So basically, I'm recharging my soul and basically loving me more. Because baby, <laughs> this year taught me to carry myself on my own. To be on my, to be my own shoulder, baby. To be my own supporter, baby. To be my own friend, baby. <laughs> to be my own lover. <laughs> to be my own soulmate. No matter what anybody says about Talaja Malika, okay? That baby had to carry herself this year. Nobody but her and God. And my kids, they my biggest cheerleaders. And they the reason why I really, really keep it pushing. But baby... If people's actions don't match up with their words, they don't mean nothing, baby. No matter what they say, if they trying to tell you one thing and their actions don't match up with their words, they didn't mean that shit. Y'all got to understand that and take that. Like, people can switch up on you so quickly. You got to be prepared for that, man. And that's why I said this year taught me, baby. So, as a result, guess what I'm doing? I'm leveling up. <laughs> I'm looking good. <laughs> I'm loving myself. And I'm letting things be. <laughs> As I should, right? What's the point? Baby, life on life. One minute you don't have, <laughs> the next minute your cup is overflowing. That's because that's God's grace, baby. And God is the greatest. So here I am at in the Aki 
to the pot with the salt fish and the vegetables. It's this bug crawling, y'all, and I want to kill it. But I'm doing this voice over, and I'm trying not to move so crazy. But I'm trying to wait this to get closer to me because this chair that I'm sitting in is rather squeaky. But, baby, you got to go. But let me tell y'all, ain't nothing but God. God worked on my attitude. He worked on my approach to things. He worked on my mind. He worked on my reactions. And every day, I ask God. I pray. When I say, y'all, I was on my knees, baby, every day, every day I pray, I said, God, create in me a pure heart and grant me a new and right spirit. Like, help me create that new spirit in me. Because, baby, I know that he has yet to forsake me. Like, they may not be paid on time, but my bills get paid. My home is clean. My family is fed. This is my form of wealth, y'all. Baby, I had to get down low to show y'all that this food right here, I think I should be stopping this voiceover and let y'all hear what I'm saying because I, I don't play. Let me let me see what I'm saying. Oh, this is about to be the bomb. Like, I just know that it's about to be the bomb. Bless this food I'm about to receive for the nourishment of my body for Christ's sake. Amen. Y'all want to see me try it? I got to get low. Mmm. Mm. Baby, you appreciate life so much better when you look up and you know you about to receive this, something good like this. Like, baby, y'all better start cooking y'all food. There's no reason not to. Tell y'all, cook. Cook y'all food. Cook for y'all family. Stop playing. Because my biggest thing is, what's the reason not to? Like, why not? Like, what's your reason not to cook again? Like, I just want to know. Like, I genuinely want to know. Like, why y'all not cooking? Because <laughs> to me, it would never make any sense. Like, I would never understand. I will never understand, like never in my life will I be able to understand why you're not cooking. Let me tell y'all what happened yesterday. My kids was like, mom, you been cooking every day. Can you please get us fast food take out? They want a Burger King, y'all. And guess what? My oldest daughter brought it. I didn't have to buy it. That's how bad they wanted it. I'm like, no, it's food that I cook that we can eat. Yeah, guess what they got? Burger King. They're still in my refrigerator. Wait. This stuff right here. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna take it up a little ninja because I want a little more razzle dazzle. So y'all see it. I got country cooking jerk seasoning. I'm gonna add some of that to it. Give it that razzle, good old dazzle, but dazzle that I'm talking about, okay? Okay. Let me just take it up a notch. Cook how you like. Do as you please. It's just what I like to do. And that's how we gonna do this, son. Now, let's add the rest of this without the juice. To the best of my ability. All right. That's all I'm going to have it to give. It's been real. Thanks for tuning in to this Elijah Malika show. Making Aki and Saltfish with me. I'll be good. Oh, that jerk just made it smell so divine. All right. So if y'all don't, y'all made it this far in the video, y'all know Talaja Malika just made some Aki and saltfish. And baby, she also made some rice. I'm going to eat mine with rice because that's what I like. And that's what I'm doing. 
and there's nothing wrong with that okay now what you like to do is nothing wrong with that either just do you because i'm gonna do me with gladness in my heart though like I have no shame in my game doing me. Okay? Okay? Mm, 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 mm. Baby. Oh, I'm using the wrong thing. When I say it's so good, mm, 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 mm. I ain't done yet, though. Excuse me. Thank you. Baby, it smells so good. So I have this from Trader Joe's. Y'all know I love me some Trader Joe's. And I'm gonna pair me some guacamole. We got move, shaking your head no for to my good old. And this is a, um, I wanna say this is a spicy one. This is what it looks like when you open it, y'all. Can y'all see? Let me give it a little mix up. Get everything nice and copacetic. I'm gonna end up putting this in a jar since it's open. But baby, I love guacamole. And no, I didn't feel like making that. And this is what I got going on, baby. Aki and saltfish with some pear, but instead of pear, I wish I had a plantain, something sweet, a yam, but yeah. So he says this prayer that he blesses over our food is just so dope and I need to learn it. So can you teach me the prayer, sir, please and thank you. But Father God, I come to you saying thank you. Thank you for this beautiful Sunday. Thank you for my spirit being so amazing and divine and nurturing. Very, very attractive, Father God. I want to say thank you for that energy, Father God. I want to say thank you for the courage to keep on keeping on that you give me, Father God. Bless over this food that I am about to receive for the nourishment of my body. Christ's sakes, amen. Yes. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Y'all ready for this? Dun, dun, dun. Y'all ready for this? Dun, dun, dun. Y'all ready for this? Go, go, get out of my kitchen. Go, I want you out of my kitchen, sir. I want you out of my kitchen. Y'all ready for this? Dun, dun, dun. He's just being like a bad boy, and I don't know why. But I'm gonna need for him to stop. Yeah, I'm gonna pull up to y'all. I ain't even gonna change up my lighting and reset stuff up, baby. I'm going to pull up to the scene by myself, okay? Father God, bless this food. He don't care. I want to taste this by itself. That guacamole, the bomb. You want your food? Your food outside, sir. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mmm. Then you got a little kick to it. Mm. Yeah. A little nice little kick to it. Too nice of a kick to it. Mm, 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 mm. I went back in with a little bit of more um, fish seasoning, the Maggie. And of course I hit it with some more um, jerk seasoning. So yeah, this is what's going on, baby. All right. It's been real. I gotta go because I'm being watched. Yeah, I'm being watched, y'all. Like, real bad. Like, he be watching me. Like, why is he watching me? Like, why you watching me? Yeah, yeah, why you watching me? Like, you watching me real bad. Yeah, go ahead. Go home. Get out of my kitchen. Tell my son. Let me get out this girl's face because why she got me on camera? Like, he fits, when I say he fits in so perfectly to, with my family, he fits in so perfectly with my family. It don't make no sense, but he got to listen too. Everybody has to listen. I want to listen to somebody too, God. 
these kids don't want to listen to me the ability and the reward and the abundance that comes with listening yeah god i listen to god yeah. look what's taking place in my life like that inner that inner peace within me like it's my divine birthright to be doing what i'm doing right now it is my divine birthright to be right in this season where I'm in. Being a homemaker. I love it here, y'all. I love it here. Be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. Baby. I mean, if y'all make this. Or if y'all ever heard of it. Or would y'all make it? It's acting as saltfish. It's for the win, baby. I gotta say I'm in